Welcome back to Wasteland 2. We're checking around the old prison here, looking for a man named Red, who apparently knows how to get through the radiation cloud so we can get to DeMonta. So, let's just keep taking a look around and see what we can find. Combination lock on the swinging door, a red scorpion militia emblem adorns the metal casing. Well, I would open it, but it doesn't seem very safe. <clears throat> oh. I can't... I can't lockpick it. I guess we need to have the actual password. Or combination, rather. Oh, oh hold on. Oh, God. <laughs> I should have checked that for traps first. Thank God it did not have any traps. Oh, hello there. Howdy folks, welcome to the RSM General Store. I noticed you seem ready for combat there, buddy. Cyril Verba. Looks like he's got plenty of crops. Hold on. Make sure there's nothing around here first. I think he's the only thing left. Yeah. A balding, middle-aged man with a bushy mustache and a friendly smile. His apron is as clean and white as fresh snow. How can I help you today? What is the RSM? Guess my employers are a little embarrassed by their real name. Most folks know them as the Red Scorpion Militia. But around here, they like to be known as RSM Enterprises. A little... A, a little less alarming for potential customers, I guess. Yeah. Militia is not really something you want in your name. Well, tell me about the Red Scorpions. They were a gang before. The bad as they come. But they've changed their ways, decided to clean up their act and the wastes at the same time. And Happy Valley aims to show the rest of Arizona how things will be done once the RSM is running things. Uh-huh, sure. Yeah, I'm sure they're just peachy now. What is Happy Valley? That's the RSM's new name for the prison area. Uh, I'm sure it'll get happier as it goes along. So, do you need any help? Well, now we've got pretty much everything you could want right here under one roof: food, water, household goods, clothing, canteens—you name it. Oh, I'm sorry, though. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, though, folks. We only accept Scorpion script here at the general store. No cash or trade allowed. If you want to buy, I'll have to come back with script. Okay. Tell me more. That's our local currency. The RSM prints it, and the local employers pay their employees with it, and you spend it here. So far, the only employer around here is Jim... whatever that is, over at the b b the farm. So if you want some, you'll have to go work for him for a while. Isn't that the farm I was just on, where the water was out, and I fixed it? What's so special about the farm? Oh, that's our model farm, that's right. Okay, it's starting to come back to me. The model farm, the... yeah. I get all my fruits and veggies and meat from there. If the rest of Happy Valley is like that when the RSM is done with it, then it's going to be the nicest place in the wastes. <laughs> no weapons? This shop is bullshit. I agree, Takayuki. Okay, so RSM pays their employ employees with a stupid currency that they themselves print. Which ensures, since so they pay their employees with money that they make. They're really just trying to control everything. If you do that, they... They can't just leave. Or if they do leave, at least, they 
they don't have any money. You're not paying them in usable, in a usable form of currency somewhere else. Like, they're, they're bound to you. It's like some horrible form of physical DRM or something. Always got to have the disc in the tray. I, I don't know. That's a terrible. It's a freaking terrible analogy, <laughs> but. That's essentially what it does, is it controls them and makes them kind of have to stay here, which is obviously the point. What a load of shit. Alright, that's where I just came from, right? Yeah. Bunch of ways I can go. That away, that away, or that away. Let's go this way. You hear the faint sound of a single lonely gunshot from the direction of one of the farms you visited. Uh, you hear the faint sound of a single lonely gunshot from the direction of one of the farms you visited. He actually did it. He actually did it. Am I about to loot a dead man? Well, he's got no use for it anymore, right? Well, shit. Yes, Vulture's Cry. That's about the tenth time you've said that. Oh, Roy. I am sorry. I couldn't do it. I tried, but I couldn't do it. I just didn't have the strength. I really have to find her, because it sounds like she's about to die. A sign suggests not to turn left. It looks like someone placed it there in a desperate hope. The feng sh... The feng sh... How do you pronounce that? Feng shui? Feng shui. The feng shui is totally wrong. I'm pretty sure it's feng shui. I know it's not feng shui. Although it kind of sounds cooler. Sally Brown. I feel like I met the, the woman talking on the radio. I feel like I saw someone meet her in some promotional video, and I feel like it's up this hill. Let me see if I'm remembering correctly. It's been a long time. Oh no, yeah, I think... Yeah, I think that's her. Yeah, that is her, okay. She's got a fancy get up in that picture. Damn. It's the fever. The scorpions killed our doc, and the medicine at the company store costs too much. My my Elroy went to the Temple of Titan for medicine a week ago, but I fear something's happened. Please, Rangers, do, do me a kindness and kill me. There's some valuables in the drawer. You can take them, just kill me. Uh... Can, can I just give you medicine? In, instead? You want us to kill you? Please, Rangers. Do the right thing. I... Can I just give you medicine? That's nice, more medicine. I can feel my bones cracking. Oh, God, what? Bones cracking from the fever? What exactly do you have?
What, what about Elroy? Can I seriously not just get you medicine? Is it too late? I mean, what? I really don't want to kill you. But she does want us to do it. Uh, which I don't think she would do unless... She was sure she's gonna die. Uh... Fuck. She's probably going to just die in horrible pain, but... I just want to go look for medicine. Wait, can I use, like, my skills on her? No. I mean, I don't have anything that would work, do I? antibiotics, but I can't seem to use them. It's no use, I'm too far gone. Too far gone, so it doesn't even matter if I find medicine, is what she's saying. I guess I'll do it. Sorry, Anna. There's only a 67% chance to hit. Please don't make me do this twice. That's a weird blood stain. Hope you did that for the right reasons, Rangers. Well, I didn't take... I did <laughs> What's the wrong reason to do it? It's not like it provided me much benefit to shoot her. If anything, it cost me a bullet. And my mental health. I don't even want to take her stuff. What is this? Couple together radio taped to an old car battery. Comes gently on the ground and has most likely been used recently. Can I do something with it? No. What, what stuff does she even have? <laughs> Pickle jar. Catnip? That's weird. And some dirty pants. I'm not gonna take them. I don't know, just... Just in case Elroy comes back. At least he has something. Small comfort, but. You're going to. T are you? Not if I shoot you for. I mean, um. <clears throat> this kid looks like he's been growing up in pig shit. <laughs> Once my father finds out what you did, you're going to be in big trouble. What we did was put her out of her misery, like she asked. But that ain't right. She was just sick and just needed some healing. She wasn't going to get better. Would you rather she suffer until she died? Well, no. I guess you're right. It's just... Well. 
I guess it's best this way. What are you doing? Is he crying? Oh, I guess so. I guess he knew her? I don't know why the hell he was hiding out there. Creeper. There's no alarm on this thing, is there? I don't see one. Danger. Snarly Caves. Enter at your own risk. And you do indeed hear snarling from somewhere nearby. Oh. Wonderful. Um. Maybe somebody will want me to go in there, but I don't have any particular reason to go there right now, so... It's a whole brown family. Uh, I'm not gonna kill you. I bet our... I'm sorry, what? I bet our pigs are getting raped right now. Um... Huh? Where's your pigs and why would they be getting raped? You look familiar. The farmer, tanned, sunburnt, and sandy-haired. Looks a little sad, like his best friends are missing. He sure does smell, though. Now stop right there. If you're after my pigs, you're too late. They've been stole. Oh, wait. Are you rangers? Okay, what the fuck's with your pigs? Who stole your pigs? Well, I guess I should answer this question first. Yeah, we're Desert Rangers. Yeah, I remember you monkeys. You let out of here 15 years ago. Maybe it was good for you, but it's been bad for us. Especially since the Red Scorpions took over. What about the Red Scorpions? They've been making new rules faster than you can spit. Pig licenses, farm taxes, trade tariffs. I liked it better when raiders just raided you. At least it was over with quick. Who stole your pigs? Them red scorpions told me I didn't have a pig license, so they confiscated all my pigs. Gave them all to farmer... however you pronounce that. Guess he had a license. I could use help getting them back. Alright, who is farmer... He's one of the new settlers the Scorpion's been bringing in. Don't know why his farm is doing so well when all the rest of us is dying. But I hear he's a professional friend of Commander Danforth's. So that might just have maybe something to do with it. What's so special about his farm? Well, for one thing, it's green and growing, and full of healthy animals. Not like every other farm around here. And for another, it ain't so much a farm as a goddamn plantation. The folks that work it don't own it. They is just field hands. An old farmer blah 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 just sits on his porch, rocking in his rocking chair and sipping lemonade. Okay, hold on. Let me try to pronounce that. I, I can't pronounce that. Uh, Awater? Is it Awater? Awater? Is it a silent W? Is it just Arter? A weirder? A weirder? No, that can't be right. Fuck it. Well, need some help with your pigs? Well, if you high and mighty rangers could see your way clear to recovering my pigs from them thieving red scorpions, I guess I might hate you a little less. You'll know them by the brand on their backs. 
WB. And don't worry about leading them home. They know the way. Just let them out of wherever those bastards have them locked up and they'll find their way on their own. Them smart pigs. What do you know about rad suits? Other than the fact that they're totally red. Red once offered to trade me a rad suit for some of my good bacon. Why don't you ask him? Who is Red? Well, I already know who Red is, but... I also know he's on, what is it, Screaming Goat Hill or something? Tell me about him. Junk man, yep. Yep, 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 lives on Goat Hill. Alright. Yep, gun turrets, already know about that. Already know about the code. Wait, do, wait, do I have the code? I think somebody gave me the code, didn't they? But I don't remember what the hell it was. Is it in my... Did I write it down? Oh, yeah, it's one, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. The, do you know the code? Okay, okay. People are giving me different answers. He changes it a lot, but I think it was code last time I paid him a visit. Somebody else said preferred. You have my notes that said it used to be preferred. He said it used to be code, and then I don't remember where I got the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. But I'm pretty sure that one was supposed to be current. Tell me what you know about DeMonta. Getting more traders coming through from there lately. Sold them. Wait. Sold some of my pigs to them. Gotta have rats who's to get there, though. Least ways, that's why they. What? Least ways. Least ways, that's what they tell me. Least ways. What? I get that a lot of this is slangy and weird, but least ways just does not compute in my brain. I don't know what that means. I get I get that he's saying at least that's what they tell me, but least ways, I don't know. That don't make no sense. Ooh, shit. Timmy! Timmy! Don't listen to Sally. She's not right in the head after our mom died. Yeah, I noticed that. She's screaming something about pigs getting raped. I know the red scorpions are kind of, you know, fucked up, but I don't think they rape pigs. That's in a suspicious location. Uh, you go first, Takayuki. Did I just steal that? I mean, is that... I guess it seems like it's theirs, but it doesn't seem like it's stealing. I don't know. The line between stealing and scavenging is a little bit fuzzy. Do what you want to Timmy, but leave me alone. Okay. You obviously love your family. Well, I'm guessing that's Goat Hill, because I see three goats. And that looks like a hill. Well, I just clicked up there, so let's see which, which, which route they're going to take, and I guess I'll know the way. Wait a minute. How do I get here? Ah... Trying to hide a box next to a dead cow, huh? Huh? Monocle. That's a big reduction of combat initiative. Gives you more range. That doesn't seem worth it. For, like, anything. Combat initiative is really important. <laughs> this pre-recorded message is brought to you by RSM Enterprises, Inc. This is Commander Dan Forth of the Red Scorpion Militia. You're about to trespass on Red Scorpion territory. Turn around immediately. Trespassers will be shot and fed to my dogs. 
Desert Rangers will be fed to my dogs alive. Uh, but if you are instead a potential homesteader, or interested in viewing one of our attractive farming lots, please come see us at the RSM Enterprises rental office, securely located just inside the prison. Thank you. Ah, so welcoming. Like a warm hug. Scorpion logo. Oh, I didn't even see you there. Please, do you have any scorpion script you can spare? No, I don't. I'm sorry. Oh my god, that image. That He looks like he's melting. A bone-thin man, sickly looking and hungry, stares blankly at the ground. Please, I'm starving. I just need a little scorpion script to buy some food. We don't have any script. How about some scrap to buy food? Nope. You might be able to live like a king elsewhere with that. But here it's worthless. Cyril only takes script for his food. I got three script working all last week. It wasn't enough to buy food. How much is the food? 300 script for an ear of corn? Cyril called it infatuation. Or was it... Flatulence. Inflation? I don't know. I don't understand any of it. It don't make sense to me. This rumble in my stomach is the only thing that makes sense. Wait, hold on. What did you just say before? He, he got three script for an entire week of work. And it's 300 script for an ear of corn. Uh, yeah, I think this economy might be slightly fucked up. Why don't you work for more? That's a stupid question, but I guess I'll ask it. It ain't honest work. They say they'll pay you, sure. But every day there's some fee. Shovel rental fee. Drinking water fee. Looking pathetic and making them laugh at you fee. That one was just insulting and uncalled for. I didn't need that. Man needs to have some dignity. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that's kind of funny. <laughs> that's why I'm begging now. I, I don't have any. I'd leave town if I were you. An honest man can't live in these parts. Yeah, they sure can. That's fucking ridiculous. We're going to kick some asses here pretty soon. But not just yet. I just noticed a shadow on the ground. Yeah, we're gonna kick some asses. Well. I'll try to kiss asses first. And then... Maybe hard asses. But then I'm probably gonna kick some asses. Red Scorpion Lobber. Alright, well it sounds like they're gonna shoot me if I come near, since I'm encroaching on their territory, but this is the way to the hill, right? Oh. That's probably to disable the turrets. Yes, okay. Let's not get close to those turrets. They probably do a lot of damage. Okay. <clears throat> we gotta get this right. What the fuck? Blippity bloopity. I think that's supposed to be ASCII art, but I don't know what it says. Yeah, anyway. Uh, welcome, Red's preferred customer. Please enter your access code. Okay. I have the two old ones and the one that I think is current. End of line. 
Where did I get the current, the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? Is that one accurate? I don't remember. It's not listed here, is it? I, well, I'm glad I wrote it down because otherwise I guess I would have just lost it. All right. Whoa, why did it delete? That was it, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Access code expired! <sighs> Alright, they can't shoot me from here. Okay. So hold on. It only says access code expired if it was an actual access code, right? At one point? So if I type gibberish? Unknown. Okay, so it is acknowledging that was a password. Okay, so the other ones were preferred. Hmm. I'm not misspelling that, am I? Is it two Fs? No, that's not right. No, I think that's right. Alright, let's try code. Access code expired. God damn it. Goat. Goats. Bah. You should recognize preferred. Wasn't that one of them? I have to written down. I'm pretty sure that was one of them. Shit. Alright, well, I'll just leave it for now. Do I go poke at the red scorpions? If I poke at the scorpions, will they sting back? Could go here. Let's go see what's up here. No, I don't have any scorpion script. Wait, do you have to go all the way around? No, no, no you don't. Good. If they had to go all the way around, I was going to be like, alright, screw this. It's not worth the time. Honey badgers. These ones don't have 200 hit points, though. Here once, here once, and forgotten since. Oh, skill points. Well, thank you kindly. Four points, nice. What do I want to put it in? This computer science is already pretty good. Probably lockpicking, I guess. Ooh, five. Leadership? I'm going to keep saving his points. I still don't know what to do with him. I've never needed more kiss-ass. Ah, screw it. I'll put in kiss-ass. There we go. Six skill points to do that one. Maybe energy weapons. I know I'm going to need it at some point. Alright. Also, I need to look at this weapon to see if it's better than the current energy weapon she has. Hmm. Well, it's worth less money, so it's probably not better. Less damage, but it... Well, it just does less damage. But it has a burst shot times three. Is that times three times three? So each shot does three and it shoots three threes? Armor threshold's better. Range is better. Seems like a massive ammo waste, though. Eh, I'm not gonna use it. I'm just gonna crouch everybody. Well, actually, not my melee person. That'd be stupid. Oh. 
G G G. That's my vocal reenactment of a honey badger. Mm, there's no need to burst. Oh, you can headshot with a normal weapon, not just snipers. I don't actually know when to use headshot, honestly. I mean, okay, it reduces your hit chance, right? But it doesn't reduce it by 50%, and yet it does double the damage. Which means in the end, I believe it ends up being worth it more. In terms of the overall damage output. Just based on that alone. However, the fact that it has a 0% critical chance means there's less of a chance of doing... Y you reduce the damage that reduces the damage that you'll do. Or at least the, the average damage that you'll do. Because normal shots do have a chance of critical chance, headshot does not, so I don't get the point. I'm not sure when to use this and when, and when not to. Like, that was a crit, right? Yeah, that had to have been a crit. If I'd used a headshot, it could not have possibly critted. Oh, shit. He's still on burst. Whoops. That is not a very good chance to hit, uh, save your ammo. Ooh, get some serious hide advantage here, yeah. And there's another crit, which I could not have gotten if I used a headshot. Is it for weapons that just don't, like, really have a critical hit chance? But what weapons don't have a critical hit chance? Uh, let's just use melee. Wait, what's... Oh! <laughs> Something to dig up right there. Right under the badger's feet. There's another one. Whoa. What the, is this a prison? What the hell is this? Uh... That person's dead. Paige. Becky. Fritz. The fuck is this place? I don't see any guards. Are these people imprisoned by the RSM? It was the RSM, right? Red Scorpion... Wait, was it Enterprise? Is that an RSE? I don't know. Whatever. Alright, see if I can blow this thing with a shotgun. Nope. Mmm, brute force? Yes. Yeah. Just make sure there's no guards here. Uh. A weathered, half wrecked stables that looked about ready to sag into the ground. You would have assumed it was abandoned except for the words painted on the walls Fuck Shack. Wait, what? It says Fuck Shack? Okay. 
I can barely read that. That text is so stylized. No, it says I own you. Bad dog? Something? Wait, does that say dumb whore? Just misspelled? What the fuck? What the hell is going on here? I think I'm gonna be sick. Gotta free these girls. Hope this guy's not dead because I want to kill him. Yeah. Is this... Are they keeping, like, fucking sex slaves or something? What the hell is this? Maybe they would rape pigs. Not sure that would surprise me anymore. It's hot and dark in here. And it smells terrible. A foul mix of blood, death, shit, and rancid body odor. In the shadows, you can see horse stables going down the side of... Horse stalls going down the side of the stable, and shackles and chains and knives hanging along the right wall. And this is about this person. He left her face alone. It is beautiful, but without any blood. It's the color of a marble statue, and covered with flies. Ugh. There's scars and burns all over this woman's arms. It looks like someone's been using her as an ashtray. What the fuck? Heavy lock and a rust-free steel chain holds the gate shut. Okay, is there an alarm? I don't see one. Oh, God. Oh, that's where it says fuck shack. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm going to be killing some people. Activated an alarm. Shit, there is an alarm. Alright. <laughs> Who wants to respond to the call? Face me. Anyone? Alright. No one's coming? Free? I... Is... he dead? Who is he? The bastard who did this to us. He calls himself Pitbull. He must... die. Is he dead? I... I didn't kill him, so I... I guess not. No. Then I'll find him and he'll wish he was. Oh, shit! Um... I shouldn't have let you out yet, should I? Fuck. Hold, hold, hold on, please. Please hold on. Where are you going? Where, where are you going? Uh, what the fuck? Oh, I thought she meant like literally she was going to find him right now. Okay, she was actually going to this place to disappear into the sand. Gotcha. Makes sense. I mean, what do people do other than disappear into the sand? So what sand is for. It's nature's cloak provided for humans. But the rest of them don't try to take matters into their own hands. Can't lockpick this one either.
So I'm on the lookout for somebody named Pitbull. Waste Wolf. Chaos, Lobber, there's Chris. Don't see Pitbull yet. But he's somewhere around here. rifle actually works really good from short range. It's a little bit dangerous to shoot right now though, so let's not. Looks like there's a cave that I can get to behind here if I can get this crane to lift this cargo container. A shipping container. Which, given my elite computer hacking skills, or Harper's to be more exact, I probably can. This computer appears to be linked to the motors of this large crane. Crane computer said, access denied. We'll see about that. Bingo! Where are you gonna drop that? Okay, okay, good. Oh, and it opens up this place. Nice. Cool, cool. It's safe in the ground here. Ah, here's an alternative entrance to their camp if I wanted to. Oh wait, was I trying to use the lockpicking skill on all the other safes that I couldn't open? When I should have been using safe cracking? I think I might have. Maybe that's why I couldn't open them. Whoops. I kind of forgot about safe cracking. There's too many abilities. I can't deal with it. that lead? I wonder. Well, I guess we'll find out probably in the next episode, because I think I'm going to end this one here, before this episode becomes like two hours long. So lots of things to do. I definitely need to try to fix this place, because this place is fucked up. The economy is ruined. People are dying from starvation and disease. There's some sort of a... or was some sort of a fucked up rape camp thing. Yeah, I need to fix this place. So there's a lot to do, and I don't know exactly where to start. It would help if I had the password to get up to the Goat Hill. Oh, this actually is the entrance to the prison, or a entrance to the prison. 
Apparently not the main entrance though, right? Because I had to use a crane to get rid of it. To open up the way. Hmm. Maybe it's like a back entrance or something. I mean, I'm guessing the main entrance is probably through here. But yeah, I'm not sure whether I should engage with them. I mean, they're not actually en enemies yet, so I probably can talk to them and they probably won't shoot me instantly. Or I could just go deeper in and see what happens. I don't know. But we shall find out in the next episode, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.